Hey everybody, I'm Peter from Offroad Electric and you are watching the last episode of Ternum process of the first Tatra that we are going to use for our monster truck build and this is episode 27. Sponsored by our wonderful Patreon patrons who help us to support this channel and people who bought our t-shirts. Thank you very much guys. If you want to know what the Patreon is, just go down to the link below. So this is pretty much all what is left to do and we'll start with the airbags. And because these nuts are rusty over here as well as in previous axle, we have to do that uh, the same way like last time. Já tam prostě nemám, no. And the second one. Finally, one fucking bolt. Ah. Wow. Let's break the rest. This will be easy. I break every bolt over here. This one is in really bad. Look, these are in very, very bad shape. These, they were not replaced for sure. Look at that, how this rubber is completely destroyed. And this is also bent. Okay, this is junk pretty much. All of it. Okay, next one. Ah, super, that's not fun. No, not fun. What's that? Yeah. That's really good. No, jako tak to mám rád, jo. <laughs> I broke it. I thought I will have, I will need just flat wrench and the gun. And I need like whole work table here. I have nowhere to put sh the sh I don't need that, I don't need that, I will need that. I don't need that, I don't need that, I hope. Let's break all the bolts. And the last one. God, this one is working. I'm sure you watch every my video, so you know that we are going to pry it now very hard. We'll get it a little bit lower for just for the safety because if it spins, it will get everything on its path.
Okay, we have we have it much safer now. Let's try to do it without heating, okay? We are going to heat it up. <clears throat> and first we will try it without water. Some of you guys told me last time that it would be better without just heating it up. Uh, I'm not sure about that, but we will try it now. It's not working guys, we have to use the water. The nut is spinning in these pliers. I guess I have to heat it up much, much more and try again. It's not moving. This piece is junk anyway. I am not going to waste my time with it anymore. After I remove the, the cross member, I will flip it over and cut it off from the bottom because I need this cross member. I am done with this. Okay, no experiment at this time. We'll heat it up, cool it off with the water to break the corrosion bond between nut and the bolt and take it out with no problem. Moment. Okay, actually this one looks in good shape. We'll try the wrench at the first time. Okay, some movement is here. Was it a power? Yeah, that matka zostala. Ah, that's a hymn that I've got. It's working! Well, now it's not working. Okay, we broke it, but it doesn't matter because this, was, is, this one is bent anyway. Nothing is working today by my plan. So we will see. I'm not going to say anything. We will see what will happen. It's working. It's not working. The nut is spinning in the pliers. Let's try something else. Okay, I will try something else. I wanna keep this one because this one is actually good. Hallelujah. You have no idea how many hours I'm wasting here with this. I think this is easy way out for that one too. Let's get back to it and we'll do it. That looks crazy. Let's try it.
Nothing works today. Can't even remove it. was quick so how many we saved one one of them is fine the rest is junk and now the next step finally after the day is over almost the tube out including the cross members so what do you think is it going to be easy or like all the time. <laughs> Yay! Yeah, easy one. We really deserve it today to have something easy. So you can take a look. And now we will get rid of this cross member. As you can see, this cross member is the single wall over here. The last cross member over here is the double. That's probably that we are going to use for the suspension holder. And now we will get rid of all of these nuts and remove the cross member and then we are f***ing done. The socket is ruined. This socket got into the shape of the bell. Do you see that shape? Fortunately, I got 1N116 one one, uh, one from America. 27 is 1N116, one and, one and look at that. And it's even thicker. Awesome. We'll finally finish it. <laughs> is there any difference between American and, uh, and European? No, it's there. Oh. And now the cross member out.
And that's it. Can't believe this Tatra is dismantled. That's awesome, uh, we disassembled the whole Tatra. We have nothing to do with this Tatra already. That's awesome. <laughs> and also we are done for today. Stay tuned for the next episode because we will tell you something about the design and we have also some surprise for you. If you want more, become a patron. You can purchase our t-shirt and don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you next time.